More on the breaking news we've been following for you here this morning. A man is dead and several others hurt after a violent crash. You see the debris left here, the aftermath after that crash in northeast Philadelphia. And police now say one of the drivers may have been going the wrong way. Marcella Bayetto joining us live from the scene in Mayfair with what we know so far from investigators. Marcella, good morning to you. Good morning, Janelle. Now, this intersection here in northeast Philly is completely open. Traffic is moving freely. This is after two tow trucks came through just a little bit ago to clear the two cars involved in this. I'm going to step out of the way so that you can see the current scene. All that's really left right now is a bit of debris on the sidewalk right here. But police say two of the men who were injured had to be pulled out from one of these cars. Officials think this was most likely a wrong way crash. At around 1.45 this morning, two drivers collided. On Levick and Farnsworth Street. Several first responders and medics were on scene. The impact of the crash bent one of the cars around a pole, leaving debris scattered throughout this area. The collision was so loud it woke up neighbors in the area who came out of their homes to see what was going on. Police say five people were taken to two nearby hospitals. A woman was wheeled into an ambulance. Now, one of the men who was trapped inside of the car later died at Torsdale Hospital. Now, we don't know the condition of the other man who was trapped, however, police. Police tell us he's at Einstein Hospital. You can see firefighters working to rescue him. The others who were injured range from 19 to 23 years old. Now, we're still waiting on information from police. They do tell us that they believe that there could possibly be more injuries involved in this deadly crash. Live here in Mayfair, Marcella Bayetto, CBS News, Philadelphia. Back to you.